Hey guys, today we are going to see the difference between an USB and a firewire. So, now what is an USB? USB is nothing but the short form of universal serial bus. USB, it is it is a standard interface for a wired connection between two electron devices, including a mobile phone and a desktop computer. The connection is made by nothing but a cable that has a connector at either end. Now a single USB port can, can be used to connect up to 127 peripheral devices such as mouse, modem, keyboards and many other devices. The USB can also act as a power source for many small devices such as we can connect our mobile phone and power our phone. Now we will see the features of USB. First of all, for, for the USB to be workable, the personal computer should work as a host. The low power devices can draw their power from the host via USB and if we have to connect the high power device then we have to use an external adapter. Now basically the USB cable has two twisted pairs of wires, uh, one for the data transfer and the second for the power transfer. Uh, we can connect maximum of 127 USB devices to a host via USB hubs. Now USB devices are hot swappable that means we do not have to turn off or turn off or turn on or restart our computer when connecting or disconnecting a USB device. Also, when and when the computer moves into the power saving mode, the USB also does so. Now these are various types of USB, uh, type A, type B, micro B and type C. Uh, for the current generation of phones, we can, we know that micro B uh, USB is used and also type C will be the next generation type of USB. Now moving on to firewire. Now what is the what is firewire? Firewire is nothing but Apple computer's version of a standard IEEE 3094. It is a method of transferring information between digital devices, especially audio and video equipment. Now you can connect up to 63 devices to a firewire bus. Uh, the support for the firewire is on both Windows and Mac OS systems. It was originally created by Apple in 1995. Now uh, for the features of firewire. The firewire supports fast transfer of data. It has the ability to put lots of devices on the bus. It is easy to use and it also provides power through the cable like the USB. And it, uh, it supports a plug and play performance and especially the cost of firewire is low. Now we will see two types of firewire that is firewire 400 and 800. Firewire 400 can uh, transfer rates up to has transfer rates up to 400 megabytes per second whereas transfer firewire 800 has transfer rates up to 800 megabytes per second the cable length for, uh, for firewire 400 is up to 4.5 meters whereas for firewire 800 is it is up to 100 meters now we will see the difference between uh, and difference between a firewire and an usb now in the width aspect both are of 1 bits the capacity of firewire and the USB are 50 to 400 megabytes per second and uh, for USB it is uh, 0.2 or 1.5 or 60 megabytes per second depending upon the type of USB used. Both are externally used devices. Both supports hot plugging and both uh, both are serially kind of serialist type. Now the number of devices supported in Firewire are 63, whereas in USB, 127 uh, per host controller. The Firewire was created in 1995 by Apple Computer, whereas the USB was created by various major companies such as Intel, Compaq, Microsoft in 1996. The speed of uh, Firewire 800 can be up to 800 megabytes per second, whereas the USB 3.0 can grasp to 5 gigabytes per second speed. Now we will see the uh, graphical representation of uh, USB versus Firewire. We can see that Firewire 400 
exceeds the USB 1.1 version in the matter of speed and also the FireWire 800 exceeds the USB 2.0 version in the matter of speed that is data transfer we can see the uh, repositioning of FireWire 400 and 810 in an Apple CPU these are various types of pin collect uh, various types of firewires that are 4 pin connector, 6 pin connector and 9 pin connector and these are some extra um, for, these are some extra ports that are found in the Mac pieces thanks for being patient and have a nice day guys